this day is not a traditional Chinese festival. But in the past 24 hours, Chinese seem to experience a carnival, which is more interesting than traditional festivals. This was also the first time that New York Stock Exchange in faraway Beijing held a long-distance bell-ringing ceremony for a Chinese internet enterprise. We work together, we play together, and we enjoy this big day, and I think this is just beginning. There's evening party, entertainment stars, and the cheapest commodities of the year. The whole world focused their attention again on Alibaba, the legendary company and people in the carnival. As the clock struck 12, the figure fixed on 91.2 billion RMB. The surprising figure is the sound of China, a country with strong consumptive power made to the world. And those commodities across the world are as if the response to the whole world focusing on the Chinese market. But behind the 91.2 billion, we want to know more. By the mobile internet, how does Double Eleven change shopping habits of Chinese people in cities and even countryside? And how do billions of commodities eventually reach Chinese consumers' hands from abroad? 85,900 times of payments and 45 million people shopping online at the same time can be said to be the busiest and most complicated business technology system. How do Chinese young people complete the revolutionary pioneering work? What we will explore is not just a shopping festival, but stories behind these miracles. Luna is a common shower of Tmall Global of Alibaba Group. In ancient China, the waiters called themselves shower as a modest title. Today, for Luna and other showers in the team, is especially important because Double Eleven, the largest global shopping festival, will officially open today and Luna's clients are invited to come from England for the opening. Hello, nice to meet you. Yeah, good to see you again. Yeah, nice to meet you. Great. They are from England, yesterday morning, they just flew over. Yesterday there was a little mistake. They came after they got the car, and they couldn't wear the clothes. But I think this event is very important. Today, I went to buy a dress. Happy! Hello, nice to meet you. 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 The present Chinese market has huge attraction. China, the world's second largest economic entity, owns the middle class with the largest population in the world. But now, the group of people are leading the change of the entire consumption structure, and overseas commodities become the new favorite of Chinese online shopping. But how to achieve success in the market full of infinite possibilities is the question that numerous overseas merchants have to face. Since IPO in 2014, globalization has become a very important link of Alibaba strategies and attracting the settlement of international brands to expand overseas markets is one of its significant strategies. Tmall Global of Alibaba has become an important platform for numerous overseas merchants to settle down in China. But during the early stage of approaching Chinese market, frictions and adaptation are unavoidable. 不同的背景、地理位置、文化差异、语言间隔等等，通常的销售它在双十一会占很大的一个比例。所以你要会去帮他去想，而他可能会有自己的concern，他们不想要做很多促销，那你会要跟他解释，OK，双十一不仅仅
and make Chinese consumers enjoy more high quality and cheap overseas commodities by their endeavors. 像这边跟那个美国当地有时差，他们开会通常都是早上一大早可能五六点过来这边看口，要不然就是晚上留到这边九十点。海外的商家不了解中国市场，所以他们的货品的选择，还有他们就是整个备货的结构。甚至说它整个店铺的那个商品结构，都需要跟我们共同来讨论。在这么多商品当中，有哪些是它非常厉害的？我们要把它怎么样的，就是把它挖出来。In 2014, Costco, a brand which once wandered for 15 years outside Chinese market, entered Chinese market through Tmall Global, and Chia Chenhua is a direct participant at that time. 对 On November 11th, 2014, Costco firstly felt the passion of Chinese market. Just the two categories of nuts and cranberry nearly sold out their global stock. Double Eleven, an original recreation festival, just for Chinese single men and women, just in a six-year time, with shocks brought by the actual reality. Constantly refreshes expectation of global merchants for Chinese market, and now Alibaba hopes to open a different Double Eleven together with more than 5,000 brands from 25 nations and regions. This is the day we exchange ideas. This is the day the celebration of small business. They can do business across the board, and this is the day consumers can understand the other nations' culture. It's not only the opportunity for China; it is the opportunity of the world. This is the beginning of Global Double Eleven of Alibaba in 2015. But at the moment of opening the curtain, more people begin to deeply think about the next question in their hearts. According to the prediction of the earlier stage, there are at least 350 million parcels during Double Eleven, increased by nearly 30%. Compared with that in 2014, how will these parcels be sent to the hands of consumers? And for Alibaba, this will be a new test. The test, a globalized proposition, is faced by Tianyao Network, a subordinate of Alibaba. It brings an unprecedented challenge for the company, established for just two years. From milk to king crab from Alaska. During the entire Double Eleven, Tianyan Network will face billions of overseas commodities flow, and most of these will arrive at Chinese bonded warehouses before Double Eleven, so as to reduce the receiving time for consumers. But the past storage capacity can't satisfy the present demand yet. Miao Lan is a Shaoar of Tianyao cross-border import business team. As early as before Double Eleven, the team she is in is always busy for these questions. Today, Miao Lan and her colleagues will go to Shanghai to visit a cross-border logistics cooperative enterprise, and this is the third time they step on the same journey in one month. In this year's Double Eleven. 我们全国的跨境的保税仓大概是在七万平左右。为了双十一临时增加，或者是动员我们的 CP 长期增加了仓库的库容，现在已经超过了三十万平。Shanghai Jiaxin Logistics Company Limited is one of the new partners of Tianyao Network, and on Double Eleven of this year, their warehouses will receive nearly 10 million pieces of overseas commodities, and this is also their first contact. With Double Eleven, they have always been in the traditional retail sector, and in the traditional retail sector, they have always been in the traditional retail sector. They have always been in the traditional retail sector. They have always been in the traditional retail sector. They have always been in the traditional retail sector. They have always been in the traditional retail sector. They have always been in the traditional retail sector. They have always been in the traditional retail sector. They have always been in the traditional retail sector. They have always been in the traditional retail sector. They have always been in the traditional retail sector. They have always been in the traditional retail sector. 这些单子的那个那个申报失败的原因在哪里？可以查看。你会发现其实有很多异常，而产生这些异常的过程当中，是因为齐森跟海关指定的这个负责清关的这家公司有多套系统在交互，交互的逻辑可能不够严密，导致有一些不应该产生的异常，它也产生了。
所以我们现在就是想把这部分的问题去解决掉。Miao Lan and her colleagues need to tease every detail again together, with Gessen to ensure that during Double Eleven, circulation of goods will be normal. And this year, including Gessen, Tianyao Network has totally united 49 cross-border logistics cooperative enterprises, 74 cross-border warehouses, and 224 nations and regions, which connect in series. To form a whole link network throughout the world, but it is far from enough just with socialized assistance. How to make parcels arrive at hands of consumers in the shortest time? This is another question that Sanyao Network needs to think about. This is a warehouse of Sanyao Network in Wuching of Tianjin. Staff are urgently working, but what is different from before? As each parcel to be delivered is pasted with a new type electronic order, this is not just an order with the consignee's information, and each order will accurately calculate two billion address data and lexicon of ten million words by big data according to the delivery address, and get the best delivery path to allow delivery man to send the parcel in the shortest time. Moreover, the logistics radar pre-warning system based on big data. Can predict the parcel quantity in advance, guide merchants to prepare storage and deliver goods, and provide reference for express companies to deploy transport capacity resource. Now, Tianyao Network is bringing Chinese express industry into the data era, behind which is a concentrated reveal of big data power, and such power has already permeated into the entire ecological system of Alibaba. And the technical innovation generated on Double Eleven has never stopped since its first appearance in 2009. The payment peak amount in Double Eleven of 2014 is up to 38,500 deals one second, which is the record of transaction peak amount at that time. Besides, the peak amount of this year is expected to break last record. How to maintain the smooth experience? The answer is from a new product. And check later. This will be a new mode for online payment. The platform undertaking the entire payment system is OceanBase, which is independently developed by Alibaba for five years. It's the world's first distributed database applied to the financial transaction, and for the financial data system, the most important thing is absolutely safety and stability. It cannot stand any mistakes, especially in the heavy load situation of Double Eleven. Therefore, engineers of Alibaba carried out an extremely complicated work. They remotely built the third data center station in Shenzhen on the basis of Hangzhou and Shanghai. The system can conduct flux switch at any time, even though the computer room, 1,000 kilometers away, suddenly breaks down, and users have no sense of it in the course. And engineers call it cross-region availability. But all of this cannot be done without Alibaba's cloud computing. Alibaba will set up a new practice on Double Eleven of 2015 and provide a kind of unprecedented hybrid cloud architecture. They hope to meet all the possible extreme challenges on Double Eleven with such flexible architecture of hybrid cloud. But the problem is how to make sure the huge system architecture can work smoothly on Double Eleven. To solve this problem, Alibaba built a unique check system, holding pressure testing. 我是那个业务 PE 的林星，然后那个就是发了那个会议邀请给大家今天晚上的压测。This is the first time during the three-year work experience that Lingxing picks up the microphone to take charge of the on-site execution of technical guarantee, and people she is commanding are all Alibaba's top engineers. 
相当于双十一当天，我们会迎来在零点的时候瞬间有一个流量突涨的一个过程。那我们现在在做的一个呃线上的模拟和准备，都是为了让所有的买卖家能够更好的在我们的平台上有一个更好的用户体验，能够顺畅的进行购买和呃就是交易这样一个行为。This year's target is simulating the success of 120,000 orders. 120,000 payment applications and 60,000 payments per second, at the peak of 12 o'clock on Double Eleven. During two months before Double Eleven, the team needs to carry out repeated pressure testing on the basis of target value to examine the entire system stability, because any potential risk on the day of Double Eleven. May cause inestimable loss for sellers and consumers. In one week before Double Eleven, the final whole link pressure testing is about to start, and it will last five hours. All uncertain factors and unexpected accidents shall be solved in the five hours. 啊，正常的，还线上线上的成功率吗？还好呀，没有百分之五十多，百分之九十多，感觉挺好的，挺好的，心里更有底了。大促当天更有底。The adequate preparation leads to the s u c c e Water Cube, National Aquatic Center of China. The carnival at the eve of Double Eleven becomes the hottest TV program, and the media call it the fusion of entertainment and consumption. In China, only the Spring Festival Gala can own this kind of atmosphere, and stars across the world change the concept of global carnival into images and deliver them. To each consumer watching TV, but now, people closely linked with the shopping carnival are quietly waiting for the coming of zero o'clock. 二零一五年，全球狂欢节，双十一倒计时现在开始。五、四、三。双十一这种事情，就是前面一年你做的越成功，后面一年的压力就越大。然后很不巧的是，今年第七年呢，前面已经成功了六回，对吧？所以你那个积累的压力就是六回不停的积累，积累，积累，叭，全砍在今年了。Nan Tian is the technical director of Mobile Taobao. During Double Eleven of this year, 
as the largest global consuming mobile app. Mobile Taobao undoubtedly will be the online shopping platform, which is chosen mostly by Chinese consumers. And Nantian and his team intend to do some changes for mobile Taobao to adapt consumer shopping habit of the mobile internet era. 打开速度，然后刷那个整个刷新的频率，甚至是在产品上，怎么样在这个更小的屏幕里面，让消费者感受到我们是一个更懂它的一个平台。The group of young engineers hope to complete a miracle on the mobile phone screen with limited area, and forge different individualized recommended pages from each other for nearly 200 million users. 对用户来说，他今年在十一月一号。到十一月十一号当天，整个过程里面进入到会场，他会发现跟以往每年都不一样的是，他进来的每一次可能看到的会场里的这个商品的内容都会发生一些变化，包括我们给他推荐的一些排序，都会跟他本身这个用户的行为，跟他自己的一些偏好有关。This will mean that engineers need to select corresponding commodities, complete the sort, and generate an exclusive page on the main venue of Double Eleven for mass commodities. According to users' preference, when users open app, and the whole process is just 30 milliseconds, and this may be one of the most complicated, personalized, customized systems in the world. This is a new project. It's never been done before. It's because there are many, many holes to fill. It's not just the web page holes. It's the holes in the project. So it's called the hole. For users to open the app, it's the hole. For users to open the app, it's the hole. 对于就是推荐算法来说，其实这里面最难的就是合图，因为需要这个足够的这个素材。Engineers estimate that it at least needs over 2.5 million commodity pictures to make all people see different recommendations. Well, these pictures must be processed uniformly and then can be used. 因为图片涉及到需要一定的规范尺寸，而往年的会场都是由设计师一张张做出来的。一个比较随便的 LED， 如果按一天能做一百张图的话，这已经是很饱和的工作量了。它需要七十个 LED 是一年才能把今年双十一的素材图给做出来。我们专门开发了一套这个自动化合图系统，是整体素材准备完成以后，整个合图的过过程应该就在一一到两天就能完成。Automatic picture fusion technology can complete the work in some days. Well, it may cost some years before. And based on the big data calculation, the system can judge out users' features in 30 milliseconds according to their former shopping property, long-term preference, etc. The engineers finally create a perfect individualized recommendation system through efforts at days and nights. 如果没有双十一这么大的一个节点啊，没有这么大的一个业务上的压力，呃，给技术提提提出这种更高的要求，实际上这一步其实是很难去这么快的去完成。At the early morning of November 12th, the number on the screen fixed on 91.2 billion. But time never stops. From now, more people start their busy work. These millions of people are linked together because of Double Eleven. Alibaba calls it e-commerce ecosphere. This ecosphere has collected all the world's commercial strength now. They combine with the internet and have established a new channel for overseas merchants to enter Chinese market. This kind of communication extends the business boundary, and the continuous boundary extension has become the world's carnival. This is a new world of dreams and innovation. During the course, every step is not easy. But these youngsters, just as young as the market, think that it is not an impossible task. Through their efforts, they hope that partners of the ecosphere can succeed, and culture can communicate via goods from all over the world. This is Double Eleven, and is also a new story about the communication between China and the world.